shops on Culvert Street. Stock goods you won't find in more retro malls. So I was at the... Girl, woman of my dreams. Stay away from me! Hold it! Settle down now. Get off me, assholes! I didn't do shit! Shut up, punk! Or what, huh? Screw you! What's Come going on? on? Why you Somebody do me like went that? and stole some blast and made it from a you. Shinra warehouse. So public security started asking questions, and you know how Johnny gets. It's because of the reactor bombing, I bet. I could be wrong, but something tells me they're not gonna settle for just roughing him up this time. We've gotta save him, Cloud. Is he Avalanche? No. He doesn't really know what we do. But he has his suspicions. And... he's a talker. Actually, you know what? Maybe I should go alone. I'm coming. Uh, uh, are you sure? It's the least I can do. Lead on. <sighs> Thanks. Come on. Is he involved in the bottle? He needs to get his Glad we no longer have a rat problem. He's got all the hell went down at Johnny's? Let's get a closer look. Is there any way to treat a model citizen of Midgar? Model citizens don't steal blasting, Agent. So why don't you tell me why your ID popped when we were going over the warehouse logs? Huh? You got it all wrong. I've never gone anywhere near a Shinra warehouse. Can't my ID. <laughs> your ID was never lost, Doc. We'd have never gotten you inside a Shinra installation in the first place. I swear, all he had to do was keep his mouth shut. Yep. Anyway, you distract the officers and I'll figure something out. Let him go. Hmm? Who are you? The cavalry? Huh? Is that, is that who I think it is? Oh, hell yeah! You guys really came to save me! Out on level! Ooh. Hey! What do you think you're doing? Here we go. He's a talker. Huh? Whoa! Whoa! No! Huh? You're not gonna hold up! Wait! Don't! Don't do it, man! You wanna live? 
Then get the hell out of town. You, you got it, boss. You ain't never gonna see my face again. I swear. Are you sure about this? It's a big risk. I know, but it's fine. And them? No more. Cloud, you're scaring me. <clears throat> we need to go before they wake up. I... I'm worried about Johnny. I'm more worried about us. We gotta go, right? Right. What? It's just... You've really changed. How? I suppose it's... Yeah. Your eyes. They used to be less... It's the Mako. Soldier, remember? I remember. So, what do you want to do now? Head back to the bar, or do you want to tackle another job or two? Cloud, need your Probably help. A, monster well, slain. a certain shopkeeper told me you paid him a visit. Thanks for helping him out. It just so happens there's another job I'd like to offer you. Now that I know you can handle yourself in a fight, you've got a real killer on the loose, you see. A rabid catch dog. Maybe you've heard people talking about it. Shinra Mutt gone feral. Last sighting was in Scrap Boulevard. Think you're up to it? I'll handle it. You're a lifesaver. Doubt anyone else around here stands a chance. Go get him, bud. I hope you will continue to help me gather vital information for my research. I look forward to receiving all of your future battle intel submissions. Is there anyone who can I'm not going anywhere near that there's some rapid dogs yeah. around.
Don't get yourself hurt. On you. Let me handle this. Come on. <laughs> Chill out. Yeah. Ha. Bring it. Yeah. It's on you. Let's do this. Let's go. Coming through. Out of our way. Now. Okay, let's go. Come on. Ha. Ha. Gotcha. Good luck. My turn. No holding back. Yeah. Deal with that. I got this. There's no escape. You're up. Taking over. Keep it together. All set. Yeah. <sighs> 
Gotta be careful. I'll do better next time. Promise. Yeah. Me too. Care of the dog, did you? Whew. We owe you one. Gotta say, I've never seen a Shinra breed like that before. Out of curiosity, when exactly did it show up? Oh, today. The first reports came in just this morning. Uh, why do you ask? Wait a minute. There's this crazy story about a Shinra research lab hidden right beneath our feet under the slums. Huh. Really? That's news to me. <laughs> and here I thought you might know something I don't. Well, I guess not. It's a big organization. I'm sure, there's lots of secrets I don't know. Yeah, fair enough. You got the bastard. That's good enough for me. Tell me you're pretty strong. Hey, Tifa, baby. You got something to say? You must be strong if you fight a lot. You never know. <clears throat> if the planet's a living... Seriously? I'm sorry, but... <sighs> Tifa! You won't believe this! A Cerulean Drake flew in from the train graveyard, but these two clowns refused to get off their butts and do anything about it! Hey, is that...? It is you, the new Merc! Then maybe you can help us out! The Drake is in the old Talagher factory over there. But to reach it, you'll need to get a hold of a watch security key. You should be able to find one inside one of the crates. I forget which. Just smash them all. Recently, a rather aggressive monster from the train graveyard took up residence nearby. If it ain't the Merc himself. Just like that, okay? I got ya. This won't take long. Not 
Nothing to it. That the key? Yeah. They're nothing. Compared to us, at least. See ya. It's on you. All set. Let's end this quick. Not a problem. Yeah. That's that. Just like that, okay? I got gotcha. you. This won't take long. Not at all. No surprises there. That's 
the way to do it. And there he is! I knew you were the right man for the job. There's no denying you're the real deal. Not like these idiots with their excuses. Rather have one of you than 20 of them. They're just doing their jobs. Can't expect them to be at your beck and call. What exactly is it you're trying to say, Merc? You need people who can follow orders, too. I see now. Heard you were ex Shinra. Guess I shouldn't be surprised you'd go to bat for your old buddies. Me? I'm just looking out for my people. All there is to it. Hell with you. We can take care of this town ourselves. No more Mercs or Shinra. We'll build up the watch and kick you all out. Okay then. That's another solid gig in the books. You know, the whole town is really impressed with what you've done. Keep it up, and you'll have enough work to keep you fed for a lifetime. All well, thanks to you. And don't you forget it. So where do we get paid? The shop or something? Yeah, but why don't we head back to the apartments first? Take a quick breather. Which lesson was that again? Lesson one. Got it? Anyway, let's go. Good job ridding us of that pest. The way Gwen talks about you, you're the best thing since tomorrow. Glad we no longer have a rat problem. Oh. Oh. Huh? Someone's back awful early. Not that I mind. Would you two be dears and swap your filters out for me? I left them in your rooms. Sure thing. Not so fast, you. Do me a favor. She needs a friend. A real friend. Uh, we're already friends. So when she talks, are you really listening? Thinking about her and her feelings? Or are you just going through the motions? Go on. Let's take care of this real quick, okay? Sure. Come over when you're done.
Give me one sec. I'll be done in a bit. Ah, <sighs> finally. <sighs> so, after you left the village, mm -hmm. I let you off the hook before, back at the hall, but not this time. Oh. Hmm? Well, when we were kids, everybody wanted to be a soldier, right? Yeah, I remember they were on the news every day during the war. Thing is, by the time I finally made it in, they didn't need heroes anymore. It was nothing like what we dreamt of. It was just working for Shinra. Just... I'm sorry. I know it's a touchy subject. Oh. Not exactly small talk. Especially with someone you haven't seen in a while. I get it. Still, it's kind of funny. Us going our separate ways, thinking that must be it. That we'd never meet again. And then here of all places we do. You know what? We should totally celebrate. Let's dress up and hit the town. Really? I mean, why not? It'll be fun. Do you even have fancy clothes? Not like fancy fancy, but I'll figure something out. What do you think would suit me, huh? Something refined. Yeah, I guess we're not kids anymore. Be sure to pick an outfit that goes with mine, okay? <laughs> Will do. <laughs> this is gonna be so much fun. You'll see. Yeah. Maybe. <laughs> and on that happy note, I think it's time we head back to the bar. Come on. Uh, you don't need a break? Honestly, I'm feeling pretty good. Marl isn't always right, you know. We took care of the filters, so we're gonna head back to the bar now. Take care, you two. Oh, you're looking pretty chipper. Different? Must be my imagination, then. <laughs> anyway, keep your wits about you, Merc. A token of my appreciation. Be good to her.
would make him one of these. And here we are. You must be tired. Same as you, I guess. Could use a little something to take the edge off, right? How about a refreshing cocktail made by yours truly that you can sit back and savor? Tifa. Yeah, I'm feeling it a bit too. Hey, do you think you'll stick around a little longer? <sighs> Maybe. Work for a minute, build up some savings. I see. So, what'll it be? Wanna head back out for a little while? We're back. Did you have fun? <laughs> Lots of fun. Hey, need y'all downstairs. Uh, right now? Then the plan is... Marlene. Wanna go wait for Jesse out front? Okay. <sighs> Looks like we're officially on for tomorrow night then. Gotta go over the details with the others. Before you do, about my pay. You'll get your money. So sit down and shut up until we're finished. Double time, Tifa. Sorry, but it shouldn't take much longer. In the meantime... <laughs> Grab a seat. What'll it be? I don't know. Something hard and bitter. <laughs> people would say something sweet right about now. I'm sure they would. Ah, uh, but you're a more discerning customer, aren't you? In which case... Our house special, the Cosmo Canyon. Beautiful. I gotta go. Uh, enjoy. Huh? Hey, you see the news? The reactor bombing was the work of the eco-extremist group Avalanche. Public enemy number one. Gets your heart racing, doesn't it? They don't know our faces, so we're in the clear for now. But we'll want to capitalize on this momentum. Speaking of which, you coming on the next one? For the right price. Oh, you can bet I'll be pushing hard for a raise. <sighs> Tifa will be joining us too, but I don't know. Even a blind man can see her heart's not in it. She was never on board with the bombings. So if it comes down to do or die... If I've got to put my life in someone else's hands, then... I'd rather that someone was a professional, like you. Could still kill some time. The real deal, huh? What was up with that girl anyway?
Maybe just chill a bit. I heard you're having second thoughts. I know we have to think big if we're going to make a difference. But not like this. I just... I feel trapped. If it feels wrong, don't do it. kick you out we agreed to disagree so you want another drink Tifa time to celebrate break out all the good stuff oh sure <clears throat> we won't be needing you for this next job feel free to look for work elsewhere fine by me that's how I like it no contract no obligation. Figured you'd say that. Here, the rest of your payment, along with a little extra for your exemplary service. And thus concludes our business. Gonna have to ask you to leave now. This here's a private affair. Sorry. I tried. We talked it over, but... In the end... We didn't want to put so much on you. This is our fight. Jesse, what's the holdup? Be right there! No hard feelings, huh? It's fine. Let's talk more after I'm done here, okay? Really, it's fine. Come on, Jesse, I'm dying here! I'll catch you later. Sorry to keep you thirsty boys waiting. Avalanche! <laughs> <sighs> that hit the spot. Damn it. We'll talk later. I promise. Sorry, you were saying? Keep it tight. Ain't no room for air come tomorrow. More reason to live it up now. Yep. Best way to clear your head so you can focus when it counts. It's been too long since we did this. Not since we went on that all-night bender after HQ gave us the boot. They did not give us the boot. It was an amicable separation. What's up with them? Guess that's why we're paid so damn much. <laughs> Hey, brother. You from around the way? I guess. No big man with a big gun strapped to his right arm? Heard he set up shop somewhere in the neighborhood. That depends. Ah. <laughs> Clever. Smell an opportunity to make some scratch to you. Five hundred. Two hundred. Hmm. Three. Whatever, man. Let's find somewhere quiet to talk. Walk with me. Hey! 
got something to say? You looking at me? Is he with them? Move it! I said move! Look at all these assholes staring at us. This shithole's got nothing on wall markets. Am I right? Word of advice, Blondie. Don't piss off my friend here. You'll be real sorry. Unless you got some kind of death wish, then be my guest. <laughs> After you, brother. And don't worry. I ain't the backstabbing type. Most days. Spill it. You know where the bastard's hiding, don't you? I told you before. That depends. Oh yeah? You wasted my time! Shinra's time, you mean? <laughs> Shinra knows better than to stick its nose in my boss's business. Like I give a shit. I got your number. If they weren't Shinra, then... Not my problem. Lesson one for life on the ground floor. Get some rest. Welcome! I'm always getting in new stuff to keep up with the latest trends. You won't be disappointed. Gonna let me in so we can talk in private? Guess I'll get right to the point then. Huh. What did you got there? An apology for not getting you on the mission. Uh. Or not. 
What do you think it is? <sighs> a proposition. Nailed it in one. Gonna have to ask you to keep all this a secret from the others, though. It's a personal matter. Something I need to sort out tonight. Tonight? Tonight. You and me, together. I want you to come with me to the Sector 7 plate. I'll give you the details on the way. That's fine by me, but don't you have a pretty big day ahead of you? I do, but if I don't deal with this now, it's only gonna get harder. Anyway, I can count on you, can't I? Hmm. Oh. A down payment. Doubt we'll be back before morning, in case you were planning on traveling light. Make sure you've got everything you need before we leave. I'll wait here. <laughs>